This video is intended to explore how the mapping transformations in IICS are similar to Power Center and to also begin to introduce some of the new transformations that IICS provides. In the previous video, we built a simple source to target mapping. If you wanted to add transformations to a mapping, you'll find them on the left hand side of the screen. You will see practically all of the transformations that you are used to using in Power Center, and you'll see that the experience in using them is very similar. For example, I'm going to add an expression to this mapping. We first see that the default field rule has brought over all of my source fields. I then go to Expression, where I can create a new field. This is essentially the same thing as creating an output port in a Power Center expression transformation. When I configure the field, we see the same list of functions that are available in Power Center. The expression syntax is exactly the same as Power Center, and in this example, I'm going to just perform a simple R trim. You will find that when using IICS transformations that have an equivalent one in Power Center, that the experience will be very similar to this example. I can now go into my target and use the new field. Going back to the transformation list, you will notice that one of the more heavily used transforms, update strategy, is not on the list. However, the same functionality exists in IICS, but is now configured directly in the targets. In addition to the functionality that you are familiar with in Power Center, IICS also provides a whole set of new transformations enhancing what you can do while you are building out your mappings. You'll see transformations for cleansing, data masking, and dealing with hierarchical data, just to name a few. To find out more about some of these new transformations, please go to the additional IICS learning paths that are available in the Informatica Success Portal. That concludes this video on mapping transformations. In the next video, we'll see how we can execute mappings. Thanks for watching.